unique beauty in the building and I'm back with another video if you are new to my channel tap that subscribe button so that you won't miss out on any of my new uploads and if you have already subscribed what's good what's poppin welcome back to my channel in today's video I will be unboxing reviewing and installing these beautiful lock extensions that I received from the Janet collection and they were nice enough to send me 10 packs of this hair in the length 18 inches so right here I'm just showing you guys all the packages of hair that I did receive and I will be going in and opening up one of these packages so that you guys can go ahead and see exactly what comes in these packages when you receive it now they did send me 10 packs but I only use seven packs of this hair so you will not need 10 packs of this hair if you decide to go with this style I do want to mention that these locks are 100% virgin human hair and they can be dyed any color that you want them to be dyed the tools that I use to attach the locks to the natural hair are these crochet hooks and I did purchase these crochet needles on Amazon. I will leave the link to these needles in the description box below. They do not come along with the hair. You have to purchase them separately if you decide to do the crochet method. Now, additional things I needed was a pair of scissors, some clips, and a comb. With each package of hair that you purchase, you will receive a package of accessories. You will have more than enough accessories to jazz up these locks once you've completed styling them. You will not have to buy any additional accessories to jazz up your locks. Now, in each package, you will have 10 locks. 10 locks per package so if you are starting from scratch you can determine how many locks you want in your hair if you already have locks in your hair all you have to do is count up the number of locks in your head to match up the number of locks that you will need now these locks are very sturdy they will not break and the loose hair at the tip of each of these locks are so soft to the touch and they mimic natural hair 100% now within your locks packaging you will also receive a pamphlet with directions on exactly how to install these locks if you are not completely familiar with doing that in today's video i will be installing these lock extensions on my husband his hair is freshly washed and he's about four months into his lock journey so this is the perfect time for us to start his lock extensions now I did go ahead and install these locks throughout the majority of his head already. I only have four locks left and I am going to demonstrate exactly how I installed these locks. Now the first thing I kind of did was finger detangle his hair. Then I'm going to go in and use a wide tooth comb and detangle the ends a bit further. And now I'm going to take the lock extension and I'm going to bring the thicker part of the lock extension up to the very ends of his hair just like that and then I'm going to wrap the hair the loose hair on the lock extension around his natural hair now I'm going to take my three hook crochet needle and I'm going to work the hook in and out in and out of the loose hair on the lock and his natural hair and when you're doing this it's going to allow the hair to lock from the inside on the way out so you want to just continue to just keep sticking the needle through the hair and as you're sticking it through the hair you want to twist the lock so that you're locking the hair in a circular motion if that makes sense and you want to lock the hair in a clockwise direction because when you go to twist the roots you want everything to be twisted in the same direction so just keep working that needle in and out in and out in and out of that lock you can go from side to side you can go up and down as long as you are locking the lock extension in with the natural hair in a circular motion it is perfectly fine now once you've completed locking it you want to finish up with a palm roll just to make sure everything is nice and even as you guys can see this is what the lock extension will look like once it's completed it. 
This is what his hair is looking like after I completely installed the lock extensions and I did use 73 locks so I did use 7 packs and 3 locks out of the 8th pack. Now as you guys can see these locks look absolutely natural and they blend so well with his hair. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how I style and twist the roots. This is the next day because we did install these locks pretty late at night. So now I'm going to go ahead and cut these locks to about shoulder length because he did want them to be a lot shorter than what they were out of the package only because he's not used to the long length of hair. So I did go ahead and cut them to about maybe... Mm, I say it's about 10 inches in the back and more so like 14 inches in the front because I kind of cut them into a bob shape if that makes sense just to make the front longer and more easier to work with when styling his locks. I did also go ahead and have him just wet his entire head, no shampoo, no conditioner whatsoever, just wet it with water just so that I could be able to work with his roots a lot easier because I don't want to use too much product when retwisting his roots. As you guys can see, I did go ahead and retwist his roots and styled his hair, most of it already. I will be doing this last section on camera for you guys so you guys can see exactly how I went ahead and retwisted. Now I am using the Maurice Lock and Twist Gel and I'm only using a very little bit of this product and I am going in and spraying his roots with some water it's only water in the spray bottle and then I'm going to begin twisting and palm rolling that's literally all I am doing is just applying a very little bit of that gel to his roots making sure his hair is nice and moist with the water and I'm twisting clockwise at the root and then I'm finishing off the twist with a palm roll and once I've completely twisted two then I'm going to twist two of the locks within each other now as you're twisting you want to make sure that you're also twisting each lock as you're twisting and this is how we are going to style his hair today now once I reach to the end of this twist I am going to secure the end with a black rubber band and this is what the retwist and style is looking like now I'm going to go ahead and repeat this process two more times so that you guys can see exactly how it's done because I want you guys to really really understand how this process works. So I'm going to apply a little bit of that gel to his roots, twist in a clockwise direction and then palm roll to finish off the twisting and repeat that to the neck section. So I'm going to twist clockwise and finish off with a palm roll. Now after I've completed that second twist, I'm going to twist two of the locks together for the style. And when you are twisting these locks together, you want to make sure that you are also twisting the individual locks in a clockwise direction as you're twisting down the length of the hair. I really hope that you guys understand what I mean by that. So just continue to watch. I'm going to repeat this process one more time. In this video, I was able to show you guys exactly how to install these Janet Collection lock extensions. Now, these lock extensions do come in three different lengths, which is, I believe, 12 inches, 14 inches, and 18 inches. Janet Collection was nice enough to send me the 18 inch length. However, I did go ahead and cut them to the length that my husband wanted them to be, and we styled it in a two strand twist style. 
I do want to mention once again that these locks are 100% virgin human hair locks and they can be dyed. You do get 10 locks per pack so keep that in mind when you guys go ahead and purchase these locks. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below any questions that you may have. Like this video and don't forget to subscribe. Bye my beauties!